Hey, I'm here behind the scenes today. <laughs> Yay! Don't judge, but I'm here. <laughs> oh, come on, Jana. I don't even have makeup on yet. Like, I no judgment have, here. I don't even have clothes on yet. I just got out of the shower, so don't judge. <laughs> I have a robe on. Yeah. I'm not live in a robe. <laughs> Oh, bless your hearts. We went on Facebook to shut us down for nudity. I know. No, I've got a robe on, but yeah. Okay. So carry on, girls. <laughs> oh, bless your heart. Oh, Anybody God. have any wins? Where's oh, this has got to go. Let's see. Come on, somebody's got some wins. I know. No, I do. had a win actually last night. Um, so my fashion fix, I live in the tiniest town in Utah, you guys. And my fashion fix never arrives on time. And it came <laughs> yesterday. And so I did an impromptu live and did pre-claims. And then I um I always accessorize with those exclusive pieces and so I did sets with those and then I added some more sets and I beyond my pre-claims I sold 20 pieces of jewelry last night so I was I was pretty good happy when I went to bed last night good for you good for you good. well good deal well, I have a win. My husband had an MRI on Monday, yesterday. And so I wasn't around yesterday. And he, we got results with the results popped up and it said no sign of any prostate cancer. So we're really happy about that. <laughs> Praise God for Excellent. that. Excellent. So we'll take that one. Yes. Yeah. Well, Sedaria. Yes, I'm here. How are you today? Hi. I'm good. How are you? Wonderful. You look beautiful. Uh, well, thank you. I'm a little, a little sweet, but it's okay. I'm going to cool off in a second here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I am rolling. So y'all just bear with the shaky and bumpy. Um, so today he went over uh, points 14 and 15. Hold on. My dog. Okay, there we go with the uh, promoting. So today he went 14 was verbal commercial. I'm trying to remember where I some somewhere I was. I can't remember if some other some other business thing before. And I think we had to break off into groups and do a commercial for for something. Or more, maybe maybe it was that just kind of do your like elevator pitch, so to speak. Um, so this is something that he said we all need to be using our verbal commercials, which should be about two minutes long. Okay. Um, he says you can use it to encourage your team as far as attending events, um, core rank or getting business partners at it, getting to their 10 business partners. What other things that we can do in our business as far as what could we make a commercial, a verbal commercial? So for us, you could just say, it's really just like a little two minute, three minute training. So that could be on, on anything. That could be on uh, ordering, new releases, that could be on set up for vending events or organization. Um, so we have a lot of different things in our business that we can just do these quick uh, commercials for our team. Just simple, like I said, just simple things um, as far as using back office, how to find certain information in the back office. All of those things are something that we could do. Now he also, so he gave us this question that we can use to start off any question or any commercial. Have you heard the news is the question. Have you heard the news? So we can, you can use that, especially if we have promotions for the month. 
uh, we can use that. Hey, have y'all heard the news? Or have you heard the news this month? Da 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 da. So that's he said that's the catchphrase. That's your that's your hook. Have you heard the news? Is what you could use to start off if it fits to um, start off your commercials with. Point fifteen was is problem solving, solving problems. So we're gonna I'm gonna do this a little differently. We're uh, because he gave us some, but I don't necessarily think these apply to us. So I'm going to ask you all to participate in this. What are some problems that we have in our business that we could start to make, uh, that we can help set up the solution for? Don't all speak at one time. Do you, want, do you want me to? Go ahead. Okay, I'm going to use 14 and 15 together because okay. I'm going to say, have you heard, I didn't say news, but have you heard that the open enrollment for EMP, not enrollment, but um, you can register for EMP or the passport trip? Have you have you heard that or have you realized that or do you know it's all the same same sentence? Do you know that the passport trip is, you can't register after the end of October. So have you registered? Now there's there's a problem. No, I don't have the money to go. No, I can't, the kids are in school. No, I can't do that. No, I can't do that. So what is the problem? You don't have the money. Well, I, we can solve that. If you don't have the money, let, let's go to EMP because the passport trip is over in a week. Let's do EMP. How many of you have signed up for EMP? Have you heard that they've opened up all the stops for EMP? How many people, and I want you in, on Facebook and here to put a me in the comments if you've registered for EMP. How many of you have done that? And if you, if you haven't, why not? Why? Why haven't you registered for EMP? Okay, I want to see comments. Okay. Um, Suzanne says me, she's registered. Good job, honey. Thank you. Oh, okay. Um, well, I'll give my, I haven't, uh, because I was trying to decide whether I was going to go because we actually have one right here in Houston this time. So whoop, whoop, for Houston. but I was thinking, was I going to travel to a different one? So that's why I haven't. Okay. Decided so let's, let's talk about that problem. I, which EMP am I going to go to? Because I live near two. I need to make the decision. Well, you know what? They're going to fill up and your decision might be made for you. So how do we, what do we do? We, we work with them about that. Um, I saw Zakia said, um, Zakia said, no, because she doesn't have the money. Zakia, we can work that out. We can get challenge. We can give you a challenge. We can. So, so what's the problem? We don't have enough money. I think that's a big problem for everybody, isn't it? I mean, a problem for most of us. Yeah. I, I don't have enough money to do it. So let's sit down a schedule starting November 1st. So get registered. It's only $35. You can get registered. Right. But now you've got to get plane tickets or you've got to travel or you've got to, you've got to get there. You've got to pay for a hotel overnight, maybe. If you live far enough away that you, it's going to be really hard to fly, to get in there by, what are they? Are they three o'clock in the afternoon? Are they in the afternoons? But I think Atlanta's in the daytime, has a daytime one. So, so those are the things. So let's talk about the expense. You know, how can we make the money? Okay, we need to add five more pieces a week in sales to be able to do that. We need to recruit at least one person a month for the next three months to have enough people, enough money to do it. What's what's another what's another problem with getting to EMP? Um, I saw some Janet said family, family events and family commitments. Is that right? Was that what it said? Let's see. Um, yeah, oh Jeanette, okay. Jeanette said the dates conflict okay. with family events. Or, and that's a problem, but could you maybe make it to somewhere else and and go? How important is it? Unless we make it important to our team or our friends or anybody else, it's not going to be important to them. So there's your there's two problems right there. 
Um, the first one is what's the commercial? The verbal commercial is, oh my gosh, I love going to EMP because it's a rah-rah. We get to rub, rub shoulders, we get a hug. And half the time, let's get together and go to dinner afterwards or lunch or something before. So there's your verbal commercial. So anybody else? Give me somebody else. Um, yes, anybody else. What other problem would we help with a solution? Tanya says she has no excuse. <laughs> well, then, then let's get aware. registered. <laughs> Peggy says, if I can get happy to go, I will register for Atlanta, but then we have to arrange a caregiver for his mama and our cat, and they need insulin twice a day. Oh, the cat, a cat that needs insulin twice a day. <laughs> Peg, Peggy, good luck, you know, but there's <laughs> always a solution. There's always mm -hmm. a solution. Charmaine says she can't afford it. We have the easiest company out there. Here's an elevator pitch. Here's a commercial. Our product is $5. Everybody needs a $5 gift for Christmas. Just mm -hmm. open your mouth. You need to get out there. When I started, when I started selling jewelry, we had to go to events and we had to talk to people. They didn't just come in your booth. You had to stand out there and draw them in. I've become lazy. I think we all have become lazy. It's easy to turn on the camera and, oh, shoot, there's no viewers there. We'll shut it off. Mm -hmm. But if, our, if, if we had to eat, we would do more. I had to eat. And that was a really good why. But I've become comfortable. So anyway, go on, Sidari. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to take over. <laughs> Okay, so what if anyone have another problem that we could potentially have with a BP? Or can anybody? Let's see, I'm looking back here. Anybody else? That we hear or have heard from our current team. Um, Shelly Ramsey says, Alicia Williams was amazing at showing us all the beautiful examples. Let's see, go back. Beautiful goals of showing to all in the all in tour that she had family commitments. Her sons had homecoming and her and she herself was being honored with an award the next day. She flew in to Florida because she was committed and made it work because it was so important to her. So when it becomes important, you figure out a way. There's always a solution to every problem out there. There is. Um, Tanya says, hello, everyone. I'll be in Japan um, taking paparazzi with me and claiming new business partners. I'd like EMP to come to Florida. <laughs> Tanya, right into co to corporate. Um, <laughs> Shelly, awesome. I mean, that was right. Alicia Williams was in Florida. And her, it was her son's homecoming that day, and she was being awarded something the next day, I believe. I wasn't really sure about that. Shelly, help me out here if I'm wrong. But she herself was being honored with an award the next day. So she flew in, taught, all in tour, and flew out. Let, let me tell you a problem that I have. I have been inducted into the Eric Worry Million Dollar Club. So I'm going to be on stage at GoPro. So every single one of you better be, better get a ticket to GoPro and come and do me on when I'm there. That's Friday night. Well, it might be Saturday night. We don't know because he he hasn't for sure made that schedule yet. Mm -hmm. However, Brittany and I have looked. I can be in Las Vegas Friday, do the awards. There's a 1235 flight out of Las Vegas the red eye to Atlanta. And then I'm training at the all in tour in Atlanta. I, I arrive at 630 in the morning and then go train. But if you want to, you can make it work. Is it going to be easy? Heavens. no! <laughs> I'm going to have a lot of Red Bull and zip fizz and all those kind of things. But Thank both are very just... important. I'm sorry, what? Take your eye patches. Take my eye patches. That's right. <laughs> but they're, they're 
good things. Oh, somebody's breaking up. Is that you, Sedaria? I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. The eye patches you put under your eye to help with the pat oh. the bano. Oh. <laughs> your eye yes, patches. But we're gonna make it work. We're gonna figure it out. So right. So I congratulations, have, so I Mama. Have one. Thank yes. you. Thank you. Okay, That's who has one? Um, I say those who said, um, I don't have a lot of customers. Why don't you have a lot of customers? Open your mouth. You have to talk. You have, and if you're going live, you have to do the things before hitting the button. You have to comment on other stories. You have to communicate uh, with others and build that rapport with your customers online because they want to know about you. They want to know, even, even if you stopping to get um, Starbucks, they want to know. They just know you. That's human. People just want to know what you're doing right now. So any little thing, that, that TikTok that says everything is content, everything is content, use it. Use all those little things. Use all those little um, things that you have to build your algorithm because that's what's going to help grow and you can't just get up and decide oh i'm gonna go live today and you haven't posted or said anything in a week no nobody's gonna see you because facebook is like oh well you know she hasn't been participating and only a very few people are gonna see you so you have to do the work before you go live so that you can increase your viewers um yeah, I'm taking a, a couple of other little courses right now to help for myself to help me get better and be more consistent at doing those things before the live so that my viewers can increase, which hope, which eventually will increase my customers. So there is a solution. Even if you have to pay for someone to teach you, to help you um, with those skills, is it worth it? Think, think of what you're going to make back from earning those skills. So there is a solution to all the problems that we have. And that's just uh, one of the things you said. So th the assignments were to uh, think of the easiest. He said, make one verbal commercial. Think of the easiest thing to do within your business and make a verbal commercial about it. And then for number 14, make the list of all the problems that you hear, you know, either from yourself or your business partners, and then think of solutions uh, for those problems. So those, that, those were the two points you went over today and uh, those assignments. Will you remind me again, remind everyone again of the assignments? So the first assignment for for verbal commercial is to think of the easiest thing within our business that we can get to do and make a verbal commercial about it, like two minutes. The second is to list all those problems that you have seen, you have dealt with, you have heard about in the company, in your business, in your team, and then come up with solutions. For those. Excellent. Um, Janet Bennett said, just I just want to read that really quick on Facebook. She says, I'm selling my way to Disneyland. I received a call from paparazzi this morning to remind me about my hopper passes. I told them I'm buying eight. <laughs> I made over half the money from going live. And I'm selling my way to Disneyland. She was very happy to hear that. No excuses. Make it happen. Congratulations. Yeah, Way to go, Janet. That's awesome. Thank you, Janet. I appreciate it. So, so that's it. You know, we we as human human beings, we tend to find excuses. But there's always a solution. We might not like it, but there's always a solution. So I loved it today. Yeah. Well, thank you so much, Sidaria. I appreciate it. Woohoo! Oh, Jeanette says no, okay. she's going to Disneyland too. I'm going. Okay, I'm going. Okay. 
we're going to Disneyland. It's going to be great. So I'm Woo-hoo! so excited. <laughs> Can't wait for us all to meet up and party in Disney. Um, yeah, it's like almost three thousand dollars for <laughs> eight hopper passes. I'm taking our family and grand our granddaughter's turning twelve, so we're going to celebrate her. And um, I was I was just so impressed that paparazzi called to remind little old me not to forget to get my hopper passes. I said, girl, I'm working on it. I've still got a few days to sell my way to Disney and I'm gonna make it happen. So I've got goals for each day and um, we will see each other there. Whoop, whoop, can't wait. I love it, I love it. Thank you, Janet, for sharing that. I appreciate it. Yeah. Excellent, Sedaria, thank you so much. That was excellent. I mean, these were two really good topics today. So thank you, thank you. No problem. Well, I love you. New releases. Let's get on it. And we have just a couple more. One more week. To, one week today is the last day of the month. Woo, good month this oh, month, I'm telling you. <laughs> I know. I'm like, oh, goodness. I know. I know. We just got to. We, we get the good stuff. Now we got to turn it around and send it back out. So let's get it done. <laughs> That's true. Oh, I That's love true. you all. Thank you so much for being here. I appreciate all your comments. Thank you for everyone on Facebook. Thank you for for um, all that's going on. And I will see you tomorrow. All right. See y'all. Thanks, Sedaria. Bye, everyone. No Have problem. a wonderful day. Bye-bye. You too, ladies. Thanks, Sedaria. No problem. Bye. Bye.